cats can be funny creatures. Sometimes they have funny ways of showing affection, like headbutting your hand, and they have some funny ways of showing displeasure, too, like pooping on your clothing or drawing blood. So funny. Below is a list of 10 signs to look for to know if a cat doesn't like you. If you see one of these signs once, it doesn't necessarily mean your cat hates your guts, but if the behavior gets predictable and if it's combined with these other expressions of feline disapproval, it's probably a sign that somebody isn't your biggest fan. If you want to know about the most common signs your cat secretly hates you, keep watching the Pets Guideline videos. Number 1. The cat hisses, growls, bites. Signs like these should be hard to ignore. Hopefully, you realize that these are obvious signs of a cat's displeasure. Hissing, growling, biting, or slashing, or digging their nails into your skin are fairly clear indications that a cat is not happy with you. Of course, some cats do play a little rough, and most cats will give a love bite now and then, but if your cat bites you hard enough to break the skin, that is one pissed off cat. Number 2. The cat's tail looks mad. How can a tail look mad, you might ask. But once you learn how to read a cat's tail to interpret its mood, life with the cat will be much easier. Sometimes a cat's facial expression is hard to read, but the tail often gives them away. To know how a cat really feels, just look at its tail. If its tail is lashing around, puffing up, laying low and stiff, or dragging on the ground, your cat might be annoyed, on edge, stressed, defensive, or fearful. A twitching isn't necessarily a bad sign, sometimes it's playful, but when the tail whips back and forth like a whip, it's usually a sign to stay back. Number 3. The cat poops or pees on your stuff. Sure, accidents happen, but there's a good chance that was no accident at all. Cats are known to use their excretions as eloquent means of communication. Some cats use their poop like a little hate note to convey their displeasure. When they're upset, cats often forget the litter box, and when they are feeling threatened or stressed, they mark their territories by urinating in random places or spraying walls to lay claim. That poop on your pillow is likely a very loud and clear message, one that means exactly what you think it means. Number 4. She ignores you or avoids eye contact. Sometimes, when a cat doesn't like something, it will simply pretend it's not there. This applies to people, too. Cats are very adept at giving cold shoulders. If a cat refuses to look you in the eye, if it won't look when you call or react to your presence, you know you are a persona non grata. It's almost like a cat could ignore you out of existence. Number 5. The cat disappears whenever you come around. Cats are often private and independent creatures, it's true. Still, even the most standoffish cats like a cuddle and a pet every now and then, or at least a meal. If your cat never, ever asks you for affection and even disappears whenever you come in the room, there's a good chance it's avoiding you on purpose. Cats will scatter when they don't feel safe and they'll slink off when they are feeling stressed. If your cat is hiding from you, it's a fairly clear sign that the cat doesn't want you to see her and she doesn't want to see you. Number 6. Its ears flatten and turn back. Along with the tail, the ears are another telling feature of a cat's emotional state. When those ears turn to the side or fold back, it's a good clue that the cat is feeling on edge and defensive. Number 7. She seems to like other people. Just not you. Sure, it's natural for someone to have better chemistry and rapport with some than with others, this is true between people, too. Cats are notorious for playing favorites, and some cats are just cooler than others, never warming up much to anyone. But if your cat turns to others for pets but consistently snubs you, runs up to say hi to others but always slinks off when you enter the room, this is a clear sign that the problem is not them, it's you. Will a cat ever forgive? According to John Bradshaw, author of Cat Sense, how the new feline science can make you a better friend to your pet, cats don't forgive, and once they realize a person is causing them anxiety or hurt, they keep away. So how long will a cat stay mad? The length of the snubbing you get depends on how bad your transgression was. If you went away for the weekend or accidentally stepped on a tail, your cat probably won't remember that for quite as long as, say, if you squirted him with a squirt gun, stopped feeding him the good food, or stole his favorite human away from him. If you like this video, please do subscribe to our YouTube channel.